at school right now. And it's about 12.40. And we just finished lunch. And our next class starts in like 5 minutes. But, um... Today and tomorrow are kind of irregular because all of the third years are testing again. So, all of the days are half days. And, um... I, I get to take the English test and the math test like last time, which I'm happy about because I feel like I get to know a lot more about being a Japanese student if I actually take the test. And um, when, when there's other tests, I get to join the second and first years in the English classes and whatever other class I have. Like today, earlier today, I went to the second year's English class and the first year's gym class. Tomorrow, I'm going to the first year's uh, English class and the music class, so. See, that's the bell. It sounds really cool. Wait. A bunch of people are missing. Oh, coming. But, um, yeah. Oh. It's the meditation thing again. I like the music. homeroom where they go over the schedule for tomorrow and my schedule is different from everyone else's but it's still written, written on the board in a separate column yeah <laughs> For homeroom, students act as the teacher. <laughs> <laughs> That's our English teacher slash homeroom teacher. Hey, right now we have a cleanup thing. Like the, the, the school cleanup. Usually it's right after lunch. But today it's a weird day because of testing, so it's a half day, so we have the cleaning before lunch. This is about like maybe a fourth of the class. And we are in charge of cleaning the classroom. And then the other students, some are cleaning the hallways. And then other people are cleaning other rooms, but I don't really know which rooms. And I just thought I'd get a video because it's a really meticulous process and it's kind of weird. First, first you have to move all of the desks to the back side of the room and cram them together. And then you sweep the empty part of the room. And then people with, I have a broom because I'm a sweeper and two other sweepers. And then there's like three or four people with like, like, like cloths and they go and wipe the floor. And then once they finish that, we move all of the desks back to this side of the room and cram them together. And then we sweep this side and then the people clean it with the towels. And then, and then we put the desks back. And then some people clean the boards. Even though it's not that dirty. He's one of the 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 
floor wiping people. I don't know what to call it. See, like, everyone cleans the classroom really, really sloppily. Probably because they've been doing this for, like, their whole life. But they just kind of, I don't know, don't do it very seriously. So I don't really do it seriously either. <laughs> Why the floors like that? It's kind of funny. Like they just walk, kind of squatting down. And the board cleaner. And then these are the people cleaning the hallways. And then, oh, and some people clean the sinks too. That's their job. Because of how like experienced everyone is. The classroom takes like maybe fifteen or twenty minutes to clean. Which I think is Oh and someone also cleans the windows. everything to the back of the room. I, I'm sure other schools do it differently because, you know, there's more than one way to clean a See? They do it super fast. And then basically after sweeping everything to the back of the room, we gather all of the, the dirty stuff um, into one big pile. Now everyone's moving the desks back. 